All right, next step is the handle. I just slid on the hand guard. Pretty tight fit on there. All right. Next, I'm gonna put on the uh, wooden pieces here to hang the handles. Making sure I got the left side and right side right. All right. Put some glue on it. A little metal pin. Get a little hammer. Get a hammer it on there. I'm gonna give me some clamps and clamp it down. And pins are just to kind of hold it in place and tomorrow I'll rivet it on with those pins. Alright, show you what I got. I got it all clamped down. I'm gonna let that stuff dry overnight. I put two pins in. I got another one on the top, but I didn't put it in because I, I don't know if I wanna put because I can put a cap on the top. I don't know if I'm gonna put the rivet through the cap or put the rivet in and just put a separate cap in. Put a little nail in it or something. I ain't decided what I'm gonna do. So I just left that out. Alright, well, that's it for the day. Alright, it's a brand new day. Had a sort of drawing overnight. I glued it over. Well, I got a little cap right here. Show you what I got. It's got a copper fitting. I'm just gonna fit it over the handle like that. I'm gonna put some kind of design into it. I don't know what. I'm just gonna kind of make it up as I go. Just uh, so it don't look like a plain old copper fitting. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, cut some little circles out in it or something. I'm gonna cut like a little groove in it first. I can only see what's on this camera. After I cut a little groove. Let a circle fall, rat tail, whatever you want to call it. I'm just gonna cut like a little circle into it. I want to 
don't have too horrible this stuff is salt. As you can see, it's starting to cut a little, a little groove into it. I'm gonna go all uh, pretty deep on it, and I might not even like that. I might just do something else. This I want to kind of cut a little circle in on this side and this side, kind of make it like a some kind of design of some of some sort. I kind of started the, the other side too, like this. That way it's kind of straight. There's a whole lot of this over and over and over until I got some kind of design that I like. I'm just trying to straighten it up right now. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and hammer these little rivets in. Let me grab a piece of leather to hold this one. So I don't cut myself. Hammer that one flat. I'm gonna work my way down and hammer each one down. All 
Alright. Hammer those rivets on. That's pretty good. Alright, I'm sharpening the sword by hand. Let's give you an idea how sharp it is. Try to get that camera on. You can cut a circle with a sword and a sheet of paper, you got something pretty sharp. Ah! Almost got myself. Alright. It's still a little bit of sharpening that can be done, but before I get too dedicated to sharpening and buffing, I want to cut a few things with it to see how high it does. Like butter. I got it touched it and went straight through. Very cool. All right. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait, wait, I gotta wait. Focus. And I'm kidding, dude. You go good ten seconds ago. Go ahead. It's just awkward and <laughs> go, Yeah. Finally got it. Yeah. Oh, that was kinda cool. Cut it again, cut it again. Oh yes. We're gonna make a big mud hole right here. Where'd you cut it? Go on. <laughs> <laughs> Hit it like a bat. <laughs>